DMSO, what a topic. It is nature's healer and is so controversial because there's so much misinformation. If you believe that DMSO and oxygen mix together and form a deadly gas, do your research, find that article. You're just repeating that you heard something on the internet. I've yet to see that article that proves that a PubMed article. Link it if you do find it, please. Okay, with that out of the way, let's talk about DMSO. So a lot of people want to know how to apply it. So let's talk about how to properly apply DMSO. So how DMSO works, it, it gets into the capillaries of your blood and it gets into the bloodstream very quickly. Everything needs to be clean. You wash your hands with natural soap, nothing perfumed. Your hands are clean. That's great. Then you can start working with the product. Find DMSO in a glass bottle, dmsocanada.com. That's a great product. I just ordered a liter for a great price from them in Canada. That's the only place you'll find it. Uh, so this is 99.9% .9 DMSO. I know this is a very high quality product. And then I got organic castor oil. I'm gonna blend that in to get my 50% solution. When you first start working with this and putting it on your skin, 50% solution is a great way to start. That way you don't get that tingly kind of burny feeling that when you get into higher concentrations. Once you've worked on it for a while, you can jump up to 75% DMSO, 25% castor oil, or you could use a clean RO water or distilled water. Obviously not tap water because there's going to be all kinds of chemicals in that. You don't want that in your bloodstream. You're going to use to apply it. You're going to mix right, a teaspoon of DMSO, a teaspoon of castor oil, put it in here. It's going to naturally just literally just give it a little swirl for a couple, um, not even a minute, and it'll completely dissolve and they'll blend beautifully. Then I got my organic cotton balls, organic Q-tips, okay? This is all things that are you need organic because otherwise there's going to be glyphosate, right, from a GMO crop. You do not want that, so always buy organic. So after you apply it to your skin, just let it sit on that area. So you apply it to your knee or to your fingers that got arthritis. Let it sit for at least 30 minutes before you wash your hands or if you were you don't need to, just leave it on. Right? But it takes around 30 minutes to completely absorb. You want to go deeper into this. Go get into DMSO, this book, Dr. Morton Walker. It's so deep. It's got literally hundreds and hundreds of studies in here. And what they're talking about, you know, the best... Um, Football coaches, um, baseball, everybody, these pros have been using this stuff forever. And it's just, we don't hear about it, okay? But it's amazing for things like arthritis, uh, for the big C word that I can't talk about, toe bunions, hammer toe, um, corns, uh, planter's warts, um, you know, wrists, ankles when that gets sprained. This is in my, my, my first aid kit. So if I'm out and about and I sprain something, I just put it on right away and it takes the inflammation, the sprain and the pain away right away. So this is how I've been safely using it for decades. Okay. Let me know in the comments if you have any other questions and if it's worked for you, I'm sending you guys much love. Have a great day.